Hi there, Arnie here. So I just noticed the other day that I'm nearing the 200 subscriber mark, and I want to say thank you. Uh, <laughs> when I started this um, facilities maintenance series, I guess, if you want to call it that, March of 2020, when the pandemic hit, everybody here at school left for spring break and they never came back. All the teaching staff and whatnot had to start learning how to connect with their students and teach from home. And uh, it was really difficult for them in the beginning, uh, learning how to use uh, new platforms and new ways of, of communicating, like Google Meet and Zoom and whatnot. It was tough. And unlike them, I was still here on campus, uh, able to work, uh, able to put in my, my regular day, basically, with the exception that there was nobody else around other than some admin staff and IT. So it was pretty quiet around here. I could see what everyone was going through in terms of trying to connect with their students and, and teach them in a completely different uh, learning environment. And they were all producing videos and learning how to use that platform. One day I was working on a project that ended up being the, the first episode, I guess, if you want to call it that. Well, I guess I ended up calling, I did call it that. But it was, uh, I was working on a problem with uh, a leak from a fitting in a wall in the athletic director's office. And once I opened that up, I realized that the water shut off was somewhere else. And so then I had to go searching for that. And that turned out to be in the wall of the weight room. And once I opened that up, I could see that one of the fittings looked like it was leaking a little bit. And so as soon as I started to unscrew that, I saw that that was cracked and squirting water all over the place. And I thought, well, this could be an entertaining video to send to people. And so I just kind of recorded the process of making the repair and sent that to staff as a way of saying, hey, thanks for all you're doing. And just to let you know, we're still here and we're still doing work on our end as well. And um, so I'm sharing this with you. I just started making more of the videos, uh, which turned into a bit of a series, which went from five subscribers in the first little while to uh, by the end of the, the year, I was up to about 75. And then now I'm up to 200 or very close to it. It was 199 last I looked. So by the time this comes out, I could be up over the 200 subscriber mark. And I'm kind of blown away. You know, it's not one of those channels where you have a large population of people interested in the stuff that you're doing. So there was never any plan to make a channel and become a, I mean, two years ago, I'd never even heard the term content creator. Like that's a YouTube term that I had never heard of. And yeah, I have uh, everyone who subscribes to the channel and everyone who watches the, the channel to thank for that. And, and I appreciate that very much. And so I just wanted to say thank you. And uh, I imagine that uh, I will keep doing this until I retire anyway, which is, you know, another five, six, seven years away. We'll see how long uh, my body holds out. But uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching. So once again, I'd like to say thank you very much to everyone who uh, watches the channel, who posts questions or comments, interacts with it in one way or another. I appreciate you very much. And as a way of saying thank you, I'd like to bring you a short little video entitled the tale of the snow shovel that lasted 13 minutes. Thank you.